You ready to get started? I gotta get through this fast, otherwise <clears throat> my wife starts shopping and once she gets shopping, there's no end. So, okay, I'm Nick. In less than eight minutes, I'm gonna go shower you with cash. How's that sound? So put away your cell phone, close the door, because all I will need from you is your full attention. If you hang with me for a minute, I'm gonna share my story with you of how I went from getting my ass kicked in a casino parking lot to making a life-shattering amount of money completely under the radar. And I'll tell you why that knowledge will be your ticket to a life of financial freedom. Let's play a game real quick. Are you familiar with War? It's a card game where two people flip over a card, and if you have the high card, you win. If you have the low card, you lose. Simple, right? It's quick, it's easy to understand, and it's a true 50-50 chance every time. Let's try it out, okay? And, ooh, hey. There you go. You won. You're a natural. How could it be more simple, right? Let's try the same for money, all right? If you win, you win 15 bucks. And if you lose, you only lose five bucks. Let's see where you end up after five rounds. What do you say? Let's make you some money. Ooh, that's gonna be tough to beat. Ah, uh, sorry. Win some, lose some, five bucks. There you go. Thank you. Ah, don't worry, let's try again. Uh, Joker, get out of here, Joker. Five, okay. There you go, bingo, you win. Let's see, uh, that's uh, 15 for you now. <laughs> you won. Now, you're up $10, right? Looking good. Let's run a couple more off. Let's see. Uh, okay. There you are. Uh, yep. up. Uh. There you are. How about that? You risked nothing and you made 35 bucks in what? 20 seconds? Pretty good return. Have you ever made that much so quickly before? Heck, have you ever made anything before? <laughs> Likely not, because everything you've tried before today is rigged against you. Trust me, I know for a fact that you cannot make money using any other method than what you're going to see today because I was in charge of making sure you didn't. But today, I'm gonna flip the script but not only are the odds gonna be forever in your favor, just like I showed you, but the amount of money you can siphon from my system will leave your jaw hanging. Simply put, I'm gonna put the odds in your favor right now. I know you've likely heard that term before, but what I'll show you today actually holds true to that. My odds hijacker literally guarantees profits due to a very specific operation that runs in the background that no one else has ever discovered before me. Now, you can try running softwares that tout an exclusive algorithm all day and do nothing but lose money 10 out of 10 times because these guys are missing the bigger picture. It's not about algorithms. It's about beating an entire system by getting the odds of the game in your favor. I spent years perfecting this on my own, but now is the day you benefit from my hard work at absolutely no cost. Now don't get me wrong, I'm no fairy godmother and I do have something to gain from this, but it's not money, and it sure as hell ain't your money. So put down your wallet, because I'm not after that, okay? See, my odds hijacker started in Vegas. Back then, there weren't any softwares, it was just my brain but there was plenty of profit to go around. About 15 years ago, I realized how to beat the big casinos at their own game, flipping the odds, normally in their favor, now in my favor. And I took those casinos for over $8 million. I am serious. In fact, that's why you've never had success trading binary options. For example, I mean, no matter what anyone tells you, binary options, the way you trade it, it's a losing proposition, just like casinos. You never win when you walk into a casino, right? I mean, or when you do, you end up going back and losing it all the next day. That's because these odds makers have the game in their favor. I mean, you know that though, right? <laughs> Why do you think binary trading is any different? Just take a second and realize what I'm saying is true. <laughs> the game is rigged against you. 
And once you understand that, you'll see why today is the only real chance you'll ever have to make six or even seven figures. I've mastered the ability to flip the odds in my favor. Firstly, I only tackle games that have as close to 50-50 odds as possible. I bet you didn't realize that binary options is 50-50, did you? You probably didn't know that regardless of any algorithms or special crap they want you to sprinkle around, the odds are always 50-50 at best. The reason you lose is because the game is rigged. Currently, when you make a binary trade, you have a 50-50 chance to win. No matter what the software you use, how you place the trade, hey, it doesn't matter. The bank then controls your ability to win. Seriously. Stop for a second and realize how impossible this is to build a software that can accurately predict whether a stock will end up positive or negative in 60 freaking seconds. There's just no way. I figured out a way to change that. I started big and basically figured out how to make more from my wins than I lost from my losses. I didn't use a software or any clunky hacked up algorithm. I used my brain to disrupt the odds. I started by making 6,000 15000 a night immediately. Sometimes as much as $2,600 in one minute. Imagine that. After a week in a casino, I'd get kicked out because I was blacklisted. They couldn't figure out what I was doing to beat him, so I was uh, removed. <laughs> but not without getting a friendly escort to the darkest part of the hotel where no one sees, no cameras, no one around, just me and whatever steroid-enhanced security guard was on duty that night. See, these casino guys, they hate losing. They hate losing more than they like winning. And there's a difference. I had about 15 run-ins with different security specialists from these casinos in Las Vegas and Atlantic City, all of which left some nasty marks for weeks. Every time they wanted to know the same thing, how I was doing it. I wasn't counting cards and I wasn't doing anything sneaky, so they just couldn't figure it out. Well, I never spilled the beans because this was my livelihood. This is the way I was making a living. I was making a killing, in fact, living it up. Staying at 4,000 square foot penthouses in the nicest hotels in the Strip, VIP tables, the best nightclubs, jamming all night, 2 a.m. to 6 a.m., then sleep until noon, and I'd get up and I'd start it all over again. Eventually, word got out, and I couldn't even walk into the front door of any casino in Vegas or in Atlantic City. I springboarded from nobody to making over $8 million. <laughs> that is the dead honest truth. It, the fact is, it was easy. No rooms available for me anymore. No casino wanted me around because they knew they didn't have a chance of winning. I'd flipped just about every game odds into my favor. Well, that pissed everyone off and left me locked out. I knew it was time to call it quits. Hell, I'd made millions off those casinos before they caught on. So I can't be too unhappy, right? Well, I was a little pissed. I mean, wouldn't you be? You go through the beatings to take some money, and then they cut your legs off from underneath you. Yet, they get to take the money from people every day, and you can't even take a swing at them. I didn't sit right. There's no nice fairness in that. See, casinos are essentially banks. If you know how to bet with the odds in your favor, you beat the bank. I wanted to come up with a way to keep sticking it to those a-holes. I wanted to get even. So, when I first heard of binary options, I saw another game with 50-50 odds. See? This was a clear opportunity for me to get back in the game. Only the thing is, I didn't know how to because all the softwares I'd tried sucked the big one and I didn't have any chance or opportunity to use my considerable skills. So after four or five failed attempts, I realized I needed help. I set out to create my own system that would be based on what I'd done to the casinos for years, hijacking the odds of their own game. Imagine being able to place yourself in the shoes of the bank or the broker. <laughs> Pretty sweet, right? That was my mission. I brought in five different MIT graduates. I'm serious. I flew them out to my Vegas home and told them, whichever one of you can take my idea and turn it into a platform that flips the odds of binary, binary trading into my favor, walks away with $100,000 cash. And that was just about the right level of motivation because 
I didn't see any of them for about 14 days, and when I did, they came to me together. Apparently, they knew this was big. They came to my house with a server. Yeah, a whole server. They told me it was done and left with my Louis Vuitton bag filled with 100K in 20s. Now, let me explain a bit about binary options and why you can't win currently. The problem is, when you place a $10 bet and you lose that bet, you lose $15. And when you win, you only win five bucks. You do the math, 100 trades at $10 with a 50-50 chance of winning, you would have lost $750 and only won 250. Now you're down $500 by winning half the bets. That is why you lose at binary trading the way you've seen it so far. Today with my system, we changed that. I took the server these guys delivered and hooked it into my office. What they developed was pretty sweet. It, it thought of some things that I even hadn't thought of. It analyzes the brokers themselves, not the stocks or the commodities, and then tells you where you are most likely to profit by depositing with that bank to make your trades. So I followed these three simple steps they gave me, which took me about seven and a half, eight minutes. Check this out. I made 100 trades that day at $10 each. When I won, I won $15. When I lost, I lost $5. Hey, now we're back in the war game, right? I knew my odds were truly 50-50, and anything over that was just extra cash. So check this out. I put $1,000 in, and I set my software to auto trade after having hijacked the bank's odds. Now I made $15 for a win, lost $5 for a loss. Check out what happened. I actually ended up winning 65% and losing 35%. Here's some beautiful math. I won 65 trades for $15 each. So I won $975. I lost 35 trades for $5 each. So I lost $175. In total, I was up $800. That took me 12 minutes and my software placed the trades, not me. But it didn't matter whether it was a put or a call, it didn't matter what it was trading because my odds were always 50-50. My software just enabled me to make money while losing half the time. So I turned it back on and put in another thousand dollars and I set it to auto trade for the entire day. That'd be about a thousand trades placed in 24 hours. What you're about to see is confidential. If the banks find out about this, they'll shut down my account. So do not share this. Do not talk about this. Don't even tell your spouse. You understand? Mm. After letting my software hijack those odds for 24 hours and auto trade for me while I was enjoying life, this is what I came back to in my account. Now remember, I had $2,800 in my account before walking away. When I came back, I saw that I had won about 60% of my trades and lost about 40%. Not bad, right? But remember, the payment odds are in my favor. I won 550 trades that day, putting in 8,250 in winnings. I lost 401 trades that day, losing about $2,005. Some simple math reveals that I made just over $6,240 in pure profit that day, and I have not looked back since. Honestly, my best day was just short of $25,000 in pure profit, but I realized early on that if I didn't spread out the risk, I would eventually be shut down by the bank in much the same way that I'd been shut down by those casinos years ago. See, the beautiful thing about my binary hijack system is that there are a lot of banks out there with no security measures in place, so I can run this software with multiple brokers and they never catch on. If I was just to run this with one broker, they'd see my $20,000 profit every day and shut me off and hold my funds. But by spreading out my risk, I can make around four dollars to $6,000 a day on multiple banks and they never even notice. After a full year of running my binary hijack system and literally flipping the binary odds against the banks, I've made around $6,200,000 $200,000 in cashable, withdrawable, spendable moolah. Over that period, I've averaged around $18,000 a day in profits across 10, 15 different banks. Now, I like the money, who wouldn't? But I'm in this for more. I want to take the banks for everything they've got. That's where you come in. I'm gonna give 100 people my binary hijack system. 
Those chosen few will be able to use it just like I have to ravage the banks. I can't give it to more than 100 people because if more than 100 people start profiting like this, the banks will catch on and they'll shut us all off, right? Then we lose, then I lose, and I hate losing. But now, if I only give 100 people use of my system to basically vacuum the cash straight out of the safe, I've done the math, and they'll never know. They will still be robbing other people blind, and there's nothing I can do about that at the end of the day. Just poor luck for those suckers, I guess. But I can help a select group of 100 people change their circumstances while also flipping the big bird to those banks all over the globe. Actually, I already have four people using this. Hilariously enough, two of them are ex-security specialists at these casinos I was blacklisted from. And the other two are these two guys that built this whole thing for me in the first place. Poetic justice, I guess. And yes, one of the security guards escorted me out of the casino once. I remembered that he was supposed to beat some answers out of me, but he just let me go, no questions. Just a business card, and he said if I ever needed anything to call him up. That one guy who didn't take pleasure in ruining my night, and he offers to help me. Also, in the end, I never forgot that, and I kept his card. You can believe that. His name is Stan. Two months ago, I called Stan and found out that he was out of work because the casinos didn't need a middle-aged security guard who didn't like crushing people's faces. I had intended on letting him run the hijack system anyways, but now I was really determined to get him moving, so I put $500 in his trading account to get him rolling. I sent him the information to get to his account, and how to get to his account, and told him to call me in a week. Five days passed, and on Friday around 5 p.m. he called me, barely able to get an understandable word or a full sentence out. Once he calmed down, he started telling me about his results. Now again, for my safety and for the safety of 100 people who start using my system today, I need again to ask you to keep this between us, okay? But I asked him if he minded me sharing the results with you. He was on cloud nine at this point. And who wouldn't have said yes to just about anything? But yeah, he agreed. Please remember, this has to remain between us. But here's what his trading account looked like after just five days. He won 63% of his trades and lost 37%. And just like me, he won $15 every time he won and he only lost five bucks when he lost. It worked. It worked for him just like it worked for me. Now, I bet you noticed that both myself and Stan won more than 50% of our trades, right? I'm finding the usual percentage hovers around 60% actually. How is that possible? Well, let's take a look at something I haven't shown you yet. You remember war, right? 50-50 odds. I believe you were up $35 last time we played. Well, what happens if we tie? Doesn't happen often, but ties do occur. In war, we continue dealing the cards in a manner called war, which is how we got its name, right? But in binary options, this happens as well. And currently, the bank wins when there's a tie. So your normal 50-50 odds or more like 40-60 stacked in their favor because you only win when you fully win. Ties go to the runner in most cases, but in this case, it goes to the bank. Well, my binary hijack system flips the odds, remember? I didn't know it at the time, but in doing this, we also win when there's a tie. The tie does go to the runner, and the runner in this case may be you. And that, my friends, is how you strike it rich, trading binary options. We're taking advantage of binary right now because the banks are going real big thinking that no one can beat them. That's one reason I'm only allowing 100 people to use my binary hijack system. If more than at about 100 use it, the banks will catch on pretty quick and we'll get the virtual punch in the face. Imagine what it'd look like if 2,000 of us walked into a casino and all of us started trading big. They'd know something was up and we'd be kicked out. But if only 100 of us do it, and we spread it across multiple casinos, they'll never know. See, it's not illegal to do what we're doing. The banks just don't like it. So we need to fly under the radar by letting all the other people continue to trade like they currently are, making the banks rich. Us, on the other hand, 
People on the inside with me will cash in to the tune of about $1,250 in net profits every 18 minutes. It's important to know that I'm being honest with you here. I'm not trying to game you into believing that you'll be trading at 97% accuracy or some ridiculous BS. But from now on, regardless of whether you get my binary hijack system or not, don't fall for that crap, okay? And anyway, in return for my honesty and generosity, there are rules. Rules that you have to abide by. Rule number one is, if you don't use it, you lose it. <laughs> by committing to me today and taking my ridiculously advanced platform that ensures you win more than you lose, you are committing to use it because I want every one of the 100 people out there to beat the banks that they sign up with. We only want to help people who can commit to change. Make sense? There's a long line of people who want your spot. If you aren't ready, no problem. This amount of money can be too much for some people. So if you're not ready to get out of the hamster wheel and stop losing, I totally understand. Now, rule number two is when you start making more than $1,000 a day with one bank, you have to establish another bank. Once you sign into my system, I'll point you in the right direction. So you need to pay attention to the steps after signing up with the first bank. We can't fly under the radar if some wise ass makes $10,000 a day with this off one bank. You get it? So now we've cleared the air and you're definitely committed. Let's make you the next millionaire. Take a second and think about your life as a millionaire. Hmm? I'm going to ask you about this in a minute. Imagine this amount of money sitting in your account right now as if it was already there. It all started here. Let me show you. Look at the gross profit and loss column. As you can see, this is just more evidence of how this is working for me. But let me show you how Stan is performing now. I know I'm beating a dead horse here, but remember, you can't say a word about this, all right? <laughs> Man, Stan is balls to the wall all the time. He has this software trading all day long with something like 15 different brokers. He flies super under the radar and plays by the rules, and he's about to have a million dollars in his bank. Listen to his voicemail he sent me the other day. It's actually kind of hilarious. Hey Nick, it's Stan. Listen to this shit. I got one of those private jet brokerages last week. I took a flight to see my mom and dad up in New York, and guess who I saw when I got off the plane? <laughs> None other than <laughs> Yeah, my old boss at the casino. I'll never forget the look on that jackass's face when he saw me getting off a bigger jet than he was getting on. <laughs> well, anyway, I'll be in the city all week catching some shows and doing some shopping. If you feel like coming up, man, let me know. Rooms are on me at the Four Seasons. Talk soon, buddy. <laughs> oh man, Stan, that big galoot, he is loving it. Personally, I don't have a jet brokerage service because I don't mind flying first class. Strangely enough, I, I really don't like expensive things. No Ferrari for me, no gold watches. It, well, I do like expensive wine and champagne, but that's not why I continue to make these insane profits every day. I do it for what the money gives me. Total and complete freedom to do whatever the hell I want, whenever I want, with whomever I want. I've had dinner with film actors and actresses after the Golden Globes. I've learned to scuba dive and I've gone diving 20 times in exotic places I never even heard of until I booked the tickets. I've given over $50,000 to charity, boom, just this year to support causes that I feel need help. I've gotten back into working out and I feel better than I ever have. I do what I want to do. And all of this is thanks to my binary hijack system. I don't care about the money as much as I care about the lifestyle it gives me. I don't have to work. I'm free to up and leave whenever I want. That's better than any bank statement could ever be. I don't live a lavish lifestyle. But one thing I did make sure was to grab my dream house. This here is my brother's dump. My place is a $3.5 million house in Florida with a pool. When I bought it, the seller threw in his 2014 Maserati, seven bedrooms, nine baths, covering 5,750 square feet of prime land in South Beach, Florida. 
the pictures, they don't do it justice. That's where I perform my daily grind. And I'm loving the commute these days. Get it? I don't go anywhere. <laughs> but it's things like that that are really possible if you get out of the stranglehold these banks have on you and you use the binary hijack system. With the odds in your favor and you winning more than you lose, it's only a matter of time. But the clock doesn't start until you establish your account. Imagine walking into a casino knowing that you couldn't lose. Well, that's how the binary banks feel when you walk in. They say you, they see you as a dollar sign. And when you take that dollar sign away from them, they feel it. And that's what I want to do. I want to take these banks for as much money as we can. That's what my system is going to do. Guarantees that the system, the game, it's always in your favor. So, look, what you do with your money is up to you. Fly private, buy a sports car, pay down debt. I really don't care. But I know that you have things you need to take care of, things that you want and things that you want getting for yourself. This isn't like when you buy a lottery ticket and you spend an hour imagining what you do with $250 million or whatever. This is about being greedy. What do you want, right? Forget about the charities and the friends you'd like to help out for a second and think about what you want. I bet the life you really want is financially out of reach, right? Well, not anymore. This is real and tangible. Money you will get. Not money you hope you might randomly win when the lucky numbers come up on Wednesday. Now, well, I can't rig the lottery for you. I can guarantee you will profit if you use the binary hijack system. So now, the rest of your life is up to you. If you want to see if you're in time to be one of the 100 that fills the spot for my hijack system, and you agree to rules number one, and numbers two that I mentioned before, Enter your name and your email below the video. If there's still a spot available, you'll see a short video explaining how you get started. If we are full at 100, you'll see a sold out sign, but we'll add you to the waiting list, which is first come, first serve. So, stop wasting time. Enter your info below and let my binary hijack system make you rich.